How you doing guys? Like, share, subscribe. Well, today is Friday, November 4th, 2022. After work, it's about 4 p.m. right now. And uh, you could probably guess where I'm at. Uh, you probably can't because there's no landmark or something to show it. But I am at McDonald's near my uh, place. Uh, and I'm gonna be ordering my second McRib. There you go. So, uh, join me on this. Um, line is pretty long. I, this is like a dual drive through. So, there's about, I would say, total of five cars on each side in front of me. I'll make it uh, eight cars now. I mean, eight cars total. So, all right, we'll see how long it takes, but it's Friday, early evening, and there is a long line. So, we'll let it ride. Alright, go ahead and order. Yeah, let me get a McRib and a regular fries. Okay. That'll be it. Thank you. All right, guys, so that uh, drive through took me over 15 minutes to go through. So, uh, you guys tell me your experience with it, but this is the McDonald's that near that's near my place. Well, I have another McDonald's closer, but uh, I choose this one because of the location and easy access to get in. But of course, it took me, it took a while to get through it. Yeah, over 15 minutes, so. But we'll see when I get home. I'll show you what the McRib looks like. Uh, I just wanted to uh, say also not all uh, McRibs, depending on location of the McDonald's, is the same. Uh, it's the way they prepare it and present it, so. Uh, We'll see how it looks. If you recall the first time uh, that I got the McRib uh, uh, last week, uh, I mean, it looked, to me, it looked perfect. But we'll see how this one looks. So I'll catch you guys right back when uh, I get home. All right. All right, guys, here is my second McRib of the season i guess is a 2022 season uh my first mcrib i got it uh, sometime last week and this is my second today is november 4th friday november 4th at right now it's about 4 30 p.m i had a long time spent on in the uh, mcdonald's drive through but finally got home and here it is so Let's take a look at it and see what the presentation, I mean, the 
preparation and presentation looks like uh, from the McDonald's that I got it from. There it is, guys. Off the back, I can tell you this is a poor, sad looking McRib. Look at that, guys. That is a very sad looking McRib. I'll probably label or title this saddest looking McRib I've seen so far. But this is it. If you recall the first one, it was dripping with sauce. This one looks like the sauce just froze over it, baked residue. Um, let's see what it looks like in the inside because they're supposed to just slabber all this. Look at that, guys. Oh my god, this is the poorest, saddest looking. Wow. Jeez. Uh, inquire in the comments to I'll reveal where I got this McRib from. I am in uh, Riverside, Ramona area. So that gives you an idea of where the McDonald's is. But Wow, look at that, guys. This is just sad. I may need to add my own barbecue sauce on this, but I'm sure I'm not going to match their McDonald's sauce, special sauce. But wow. All right, guys. Thanks for watching, I guess. You know what, guys? I'm back again, but I just decided to see if this works. I'm going to put A1 on my McRib since, as you can see, there's barbecue sauce is almost non-present baked or just crusty. So I'm going to make this an A1 McRib for me. All right, guys. There you go. See, that's what it's supposed to look like. There it is, guys. This is what my McRib is supposed to look like with the sauce. It's supposed to drip like this. But we'll see if the taste is still the same or who knows, it might even be better, but... Alright guys, thanks again for watching.